Howdy, this is Brian back with a V-Chain update. I wanted to go over this uh, big news from yesterday and, uh, and go over the charts here real quick to give you an idea where V-Chain's at today. Uh, but the news that came out uh, you know, 13 hours ago as I'm making this video, V-Chain forms an alliance with Boston Consultant Group. This is pretty big, uh, big news. This Boston Consultant Group is a massive company. Um, you'll see down here the... The VeChain Foundation recently made an announcement on their partnership with Boston Consultant Group, one of the major management consulting companies in the United States that operates internationally. Uh, it says here, VeChain's potential to address real-world challenges with a deeper purpose apparently aroused the Boston Consulting Group, whose ex ex excuse me, executive director, Guy Gilliand, said that the firm was enthralled by VeChain. Uh, Boston Consulting Group, they have an annual revenue of $11 billion, billion, and a staff of 25,000 people working in more than 100 countries. Moreover, the collaboration discovered that the supply chain sector is responsible for more than 50% of the hazardous emissions that are produced in the world today, and that implementing solutions based on blockchain technology has the potential to cut that percentage by 80 percent. Wow, isn't that amazing? That uh, I didn't know that that uh, more than uh, 50 percent of the emissions are produced um, from that. That's crazy. I didn't know that from the supply chain sector. Wow. A few hours ago, during the Hive Summit, a Web3 based sustainability event in Las Vegas, produced by V Chain. The VeChain Foundation announced uh, the partnership there. So uh, it's pretty big news. And um, down here it also says VeChain has just unveiled its new website and white paper in addition to forming a partnership with Boston Consulting. Around this time, the summit also revealed VeChain's ambitions to establish a Web3 based carbon marketing market beginning with the manufacture of the 2D nanomaterial graphene and smart contracts so that's a big thing that everybody was concerned about especially with bitcoin was the how bad it is for the environment um you know with how much electricity it uses and so the the carbon footprint that we're putting on the world here so the v chain's looking to to solve that and uh looks like boston consulting is jumping on board with them so that's huge uh you know, V-Chain made this, that uh, deal with the UFC there about six months ago. And not only that, they, they've made numerous partnerships, but lots of them. Uh, you can go and Google V-Chain partnerships. I think you'd be pretty surprised. I think Nike was actually one of them also that I read one time. But um, they're doing big things, definitely big things in the world. So let's get a quick look at this price and... Uh, and I'll let you get on with your day here. But we were talking yesterday. Uh, this is V chain on the four hour. Um, the, right there was the Silvergate thing with Bitcoin that, that we went over yesterday. We dropped down and we found support here. And that's, uh, you can see it's just uh, ranging right now in here. So Bitcoin's doing the same thing. I think the whole market is today. So let's see uh, once the. Big markets open up tomorrow morning, the Dow and the S&P and uh, Wall Street. I'm sure we'll have some action. So hopefully we can see B-Chain get back up in to break through this resistance now that we made. You can see it fell down through that. That was support. But uh, hopefully we'll get back up here and, and uh, if we can bust out of this this wedge forming up here, get back in this pattern and break out with the... Uh, have a pretty nice jump up there. So I hope everybody has a great uh, rest of your Sunday. Uh, I hope you're enjoying what you want to do today. And uh, thank you very much for watching my video. And if you like updates like this, uh, especially on VeChain, I plan on covering them a lot. Please consider subscribing to the channel and, and uh, please like the video. Thank you very much, guys.